A carefree run through the woods left a Minnesota puppy in a lot of pain over the summer. What's worse, it took nearly six months to figure out what was wrong. This is Cuddy. She's an Irish setter who lives in Wright County with her owner, Merle. Now, back in July, the one-year-old dog was rushed to an animal hospital, but it wasn't clear what happened to her. Turns out she needed a specialist and a little something extra in her medical exam. What she likes to do is uh, hunt and chase things, and she knows where all the squirrels and rabbits and uh, chipmunks are in the yard. And Cuddy also likes sticks and branches. Back in July, while running through her own yard in Rockford, the iris setter emerged from the woods in extreme pain. It's hard to describe choking and baying, and really in a panic, she was just uh, hysterical. There wasn't a mark on her. I couldn't figure it out, and then she went into shock and we thought we would lose her on the way to the emergency animal hospital. Merle Crosdale says the veterinarian thought a small puncture wound or a hornet sting might be the problem. X-rays showed nothing wrong, but as weeks and months passed, Cuddy endured fevers, abscesses, and infections. This week, Merle took her best friend to see the specialist here at Blue Pearl Veterinary Partners in Eaton Prairie. This is the offending stick that we got out of her neck. Dr. Andrew Jackson discovered what was causing Cuddy pain. He says the wooden stick was deep in the dog's throat, and he explained why the initial x-ray didn't show it. The wood doesn't show up on x-rays. So we did a special x-ray where we injected dye into her neck, and that highlighted actually the, the stick pretty well. We could follow it and remove that. Days later, Cuddy is feeling much better, but still a bit camera shy. Well, the vet says Cuddy will be on antibiotics for quite a while, but she's expected to make a full recovery. Merle got some help paying for Cuddy's medical expenses by reaching out to a foundation called Frankie's Friends that helps pet owners across the country. You can learn more about it at WCCO.com links.